Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Signalis. We are two tarot cards short of, I believe, finishing this puzzle. I'm not sure if there's going to be more after it. Um, but for now, what I really want to do is go and find, like, go back to this magpie box. I want to, I want to have a double check of what what that's all about so we're gonna go up and up and through the hallway and it's yeah yeah that should be fine I don't think there's too much in our way Is this floor no it's up again I think we've cleared out some of this already yeah do not stand up I swear to okay so the <laughs> lovely when we've completed a room with just big mass of flesh in the way. Okay, let's have another look at this box. Oh, that's the teacher's evaluation, yeah. Okay. Magpie box. A small speaker or a microphone. Okay. Oh! Is that supposed to... Is that supposed to sound like birds chirping? It doesn't, ain't doing anything. Okay, let's just turn it off for now, okay. Okay, let me think. Apartment, blue hallway, ladder room. Oh, dude, stop. Both of you, both of you can't just get up. There's something I'm missing with this, because I still don't know what this did. Oh, wait. One of these is magpie? Bells. I don't know what bells are, but magpie? Maybe... Where did it go? Sounded different when we were up beside the magpie box. That was a weird sound. That kind of sounded like bells, actually. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh. 
Okay, I am definitely a little bit at loss here. Pretty sure we tried that one before actually now I think about it. Um Select the correct sound file to broadcast. So what did sending the polytone achieve? Maybe... Maybe we actually get... Maybe there are actually different sounds that we just missed. Uh, was it 125? getting out of that is polytone Does this change? Doesn't seem to be getting any clearer. Definitely sounds like it should be relevant to something here.
Hold on a second. Hold on a quick second. Do these change based on which one I have selected? So if I select polytone, 210 and 125. If I then select magpie, Oops. No, 210 and 125. Okay. Um, and then if I send bells. No, they're the same. Okay. Okay. Uh, what am I missing here? This, so we had 60. And then this really weird one. Doesn't seem to do anything either. It doesn't seem to do anything either. I'm totally at a loss for what I'm supposed to do with this. So uh, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna just cut back to when I figure whatever this is out. So I'll be back very shortly. Okay, guys, I I think I might have figured it out. Um, forgive me if this is the right answer and uh, people have been screaming at the screen because uh, if this is the answer, then it was really obvious and I just completely overlooked it. It's not a different antennae number. The polytone is to figure out which antenna is right, but I'm pretty sure the only conclusion I can come to is that it's the same number. Okay, so it's worked. What now? I sent it. That's new. That's the bells. It doesn't it doesn't actually sound any different. It seemed it seemed to take it seemed to take the um the signal. So let's just go back to the magpie box and see if it worked, I guess.
we're just gonna, yep, spin around behind you like that. I'm gonna have the two enemies in here that I'm gonna need to dodge. Oh, he nearly got me. Oops. So do we... Do we just turn on the radio? Oh, wow, it worked. Wow, okay. <laughs> well, we got there. Store key and a tarot card. Uh, so the only other key location that we have is going to be down here. Um, so where am I right now here? Yeah, we can cut through the hallway and down the alley. Sounds like a plan. As long as these things don't get back up. Fuck. I hate it. I hate it so much. Okay, so we got the star card. Young photos. Oh, things are starting to come together now. Oh no, I didn't want to do combine. I wanted to do inspect. Young photo store. Okay, well, let's just hit a quick save. And let's work our way through here. You can just stay where you are, that's fine. I'm pretty sure it was this one. Yeah. Okay, what have we got here? Ammo? Yeah, I've got no space for that. Developer fluid, okay. Photo fix. Oh. People's Army 5th Venetian Infantry Division, Unit 12. Anna Huang, Alina Xiao, Lilith Itu, Helena Wong, Elise and G. Not Burger Park, Birgit Fukuyama, Rebecca Liang. Interesting. Obviously, the surname Itu is pretty relevant. Um, I wonder if it was the two, Erica and Issa's mother, maybe? But Alina Sio, that's also a name we recognize, I think. Okay, can't go that way. So let's go back to the save room and see if we can put this fluid to use. Okay. Photo tank. Undevelop a photo and okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Combine. Photograph that was inside the developing tank. Inspect. Photo shows some kind of digital dot matrix code. I wonder what this kind of machine could process this code. Okay, okay, understood. Understood. Uh, let's drop the compact ammo as well. We have a fair bit of that now, I think. The scanner was, yeah, the next room down. Oh, that's right, they all got back up. So I'm just going to wait for you to go by, and I'll squeeze by myself. Please don't notice me. Okay, we're good. Okay. Photograph, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh! 
Okay. Pick up some. And a note. Leaving. I've been found out. I'm sure the white-haired girl working at the photo store in Sector C is by a resonant. Be careful. They don't pay me enough to take any more risks. I'm on the next ship to Kitaz tomorrow. Meet me at the docks in Sector N if you want to bail too, son. The white-haired girl working at the photo store. I mean, that has to be... That has to be... Oh, what was her name? It's the very last page, wasn't it? No, second to last. Ariane Young. Yeah, Young's photo store. Yeah, so they think she's by a resonant. Okay. Interesting. Uh-oh. Time to move. You're going to do a sprint at me any second. Okay, we're good. We're good. Oh, no, this is the pub. This is not where I want to be. It's the next one. Okay, so we're definitely going to need to do this in multiple runs. Where's the nearest place to that? It's up two flights of stairs. Okay. Uh, ladder room there. It's definitely going to be that. Okay, so how can I get back to there reasonably safely? We can't get back through that because that's blocked now. So, I think we go from the service room. Yeah. I think that's the way to go. Uh, and let's take some of these with us. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Oh, wow. Okay. Already? Both doors, really? I can see it pulsing at the left of the screen. Yeah, both doors. Where is that big guy gone? Sometimes they're here and sometimes they're not. It's so bizarre. Okay, so this will be back into the main atrium. Oh, dear lord. Hello? The dial ring. Gotcha. Okay, now where my heads. Yeah, the ladder route at the very end. And then it's the first room here. Okay. So let's star, moon, sun. Oh, okay. Interesting. Interesting. Um, is that going to be relevant to the dream diary? Core rot front. Oh wait, hold on. Lover, lover. Okay. Mhm. Mm okay, but none of these are the lover, are they? Star. Moon. Sun. Okay, so let's start with the star. Which one of these mentions a star? That's death. Oh, 
I'm not sure about that one. The moon. Um, is that last one, maybe? Um, that last one? A burning eye in the sky? That sounds like a star. So, Boyan? Uh, oh, I actually put it in the right place. Look at that. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then we have Moon. That one was definitely mentioned. Lover, Death. Um, moon. Moon is Rot Front. Okay. So let's pick that up and put it here. Uh, and then this one is Sun. Oh no. Boy Boyan is Sun. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So what's So what is star then? Lover death. Maybe it's that. Maybe it's Veneta. Let's try it for now. Now let's go and get the other three. Um, just straight down the ladder room, yeah. So we've got we've got five dreams and six cards. So obviously the last one remaining uh, is just whatever's left. Tower. Okay. Yeah. So the falling, the falling, that'll be tower. That makes sense. I think, maybe. I'll reread it when we get up there. Maybe Star is the one that's, it's the sixth one that isn't mentioned. Okay, so let's start at the start. Lovers, we know that one. It's the first one. Uh, and that's Kitez. Next we have Death. And that was Leng. So, oh, wait, hold on. So then we can take this up because we don't think Star is mentioned. Then we just have a, a, a sec. Whoops. Another read of. I fell from a ruined skyscraper on Veneta. Yeah. Okay. Mm hmm. It's gotta be. Tower. Yeah. And then. Star is the last one remaining. Oh, I see. It's the answer to the puzzle back in the main hall. Okay. Right. Um, I think I'm going to need to take note of this, actually. Give me a quico secundo. Right.
So we've got we've got Boyan and it's a full moon. We've got Namat and it's a crescent moon left facing left. Three we call it three quarter moon. Um three quarter moon facing left. Then we have Veneta, which is the same. Three quarter moon facing left. Then we have Rot front. Which is an eclipse by the looks of things. Then we have Leng. I can actually read the bottom ones. And that's quarter moon facing left. And then we have Kitez. Uh, three quarter moon facing right. Okay, let's try that. It may work, it may not. Only one way to find out. Oh, whoops. That's weird. My controller didn't actually get disconnected, so that's a bit odd. Unless it's unless this game is starting to play like full on Metal Gear Solid mind tricks. We're also going to need this. Wait, 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 what does that say? The light well above has been consumed by the mass of meat, releasing some debris that was caught in the nets above. <sighs> Lovely. Okay, so it was this one that was missing one, wasn't it? Rot front? Yeah. Okay, so let's start with Boyan. Full moon. Full moon. Then we have Veneta is three quarter moon like that. Kitez is actually hold on, hold on, hold on. It's like that, isn't it? Because it's gonna be the it's gonna be yeah the shape behind. So it means this one is gonna be that. Rot front is a full zero. High mat is uh, same as Veneta, which is wrong because it needs to be facing this way, which means Tez is also the wrong way. And then Leng is a quarter moon facing left. That way. I think that's right. No? Oh, wait. Right front should be a full circle. Got it! That's creepy. That's very creepy. Do I have to do this? Can I... Oh, fuck, I don't... Yeah, I do not have a choice. I have to do this. Oh, it is this room. We have been here before. An old wooden wardrobe. Ariana used to keep her clothes in here. Okay, so this is... This is Ariane's room. National flag, it's meaningless. Black and white pictures of the paintings Ariane used to make. And we've got the locks again. This locked requires a key. And the hole is already gone. Creepy. The door won't open yet. <laughs> Lovely. Okay. The last seal has been broken. It's time to go home. Pick up the 
looking and you'll know. No, I'm not finished looking here yet. Thank you. Old Imperial Seals. I am love reading these. Textbooks on radio operation. They used to belong to Ariane's mother. Okay. Computer screen is blank. What about the radio? Ariane's old radio transmitter. It's still transmitting. Well, I gotta, I gotta check 195, don't I? No? Nothing? Honestly thought that would give me something. I guess not. Definitely says 195, doesn't it? Yeah, 195. Well, it was worth a try. Uh, let's pick up this book and see what happens. There's nothing I can... Yeah, I can't change anything on it. Okay, let's pick up the book. It's time to go home. Oh. Uh, I'm... Oh, my entire inventory is empty. Okay. Something big's about to happen. Oh. Well, maybe it won't. Okay. Auntie's note. Ariane, I left some of yesterday's dinner in the fridge for you. You can warm it up when you get back from school. Please pick up the book your uncle ordered from the E2 bookstore on your way home. Remember to leave some space in your school bag for them this time so they don't get wet. Workforce assignment for Ariane Young. We've been informed by your compulsory military service period was recently completed. Oh, we have been informed that your compulsory military service. According to our files, you have previously graduated from Mandelbrot Polytechnical High School in Rotfront Sector C on OR 34.59C and have recently submitted an application for a military service assignment, the Penrose program. You have been processed by Aeon Workforce Assignment, previous work experience, store clerk, young photo store, part-time, compulsory military service, rough front orbital, and long-range radio operations officer training. Should you not be accepted by a military service program by the end of the season or find other employment, you will be assigned the following workplace. S23, Sierpinski Production and Mining Facility on Leng. So she didn't find any other employment. That's not good. Let me just grab these. Have I got a map? No, of course I don't have a map. Letter from Mother. My dearest Ariane, I'm so glad to hear you're feeling better again. I was very worried when I heard from your aunt that you're in the hospital again. I still remember how you used to get sick so much as a child. Please don't overexert yourself, okay? The photo you sent me is very interesting. What a strange coincidence that she looks so much like you. Could be twins. Perhaps she's related to us somehow. Though I don't know anyone named Sio in our family. From the looks of it, it was shot on Veneta. Interesting. Your military service will begin soon, so you might be wearing a uniform like her soon enough. Please send me a photo when that happens. Love, Mother. Damn. Okay. I think that's all the things in the room. I don't know where this is going to tell me we are. Ten hours? Where, where exactly are we? End. Home. Okay. Well, what that tells me is load the fuck up on weapons. A lot of pistol ammo, I'll give it that. Okay, I'm gonna take all of those. I'm gonna take. Uh, what have I got most of? Flare shells and grenade shells. Um and the flare gun. Um 
then we just actually put the repair sprays back for a second. I'll load the submachine gun with the compact ammo. Reload. Okay, it's not all of it. Um, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take the grenade shells. Leave the flare shells behind. And take the flare gun. Wherever the hell it, Oh no, it, it was the repair sprays I left behind. Actually I don't I don't need the pistol ammo. So that leaves me space for the flare shells. Okay. This could be a terrible idea, but it's what we're sticking with. And of course, let's not forget to equip. This is the end. Leave forever? Here we go. I have no idea what to expect here, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Adler's note. All efforts to contain this illness have been in vain. All the Gestalt workers have succumbed to it, leaving only dark shadows on walls and floors where they died. And soon, all of us replica will have lost our senses and turned to writhing masses of flesh. I now believe it was not an infectious disease nor some form of poison or radiation. It was a slow corruption of reality itself, as I've relived the same cycle over and over. Each time, details changed. Things are twisted, added, removed. How long until it all turns to nothing but noise? That's why we started again. That's why we had our soft reset. A red dream. A crashed ship. A strange gate, a hole in the ground, an island beyond reach, memories from other lives, dreams of suffering and loneliness, a promise, a search for someone lost. I saw her in the red emptiness waiting for me. We had made a promise. As the memories of a stranger rushed into my mind, I felt the borders of myself blur. Now I can no longer tell where Falca ends and Elster begins. So we were we were the embodiment of Falca all along. Stop. You must turn back. There is nothing for you here. You've tried so many times and you failed every time. Don't you see that you're ruining everything? This is your final warning. I mean, I should turn back. Falca's memory. We were dancing to that song they started to broadcast with. We fell asleep watching that movie we'd seen so many times. If only I could take us back to that time when we were happy. These memories are mine now. So pure curiosity, can we go back? Can we follow that note's direction and go back? No. Okay, I had to check. I had to check. If that was the way to break the cycle, walk away. Okay, let's do this. Why did you return? There's nothing for you here. She'll never dance with us again. No matter what we do. 
She doesn't even want us anymore. Polka. Both of us. We are incomplete. Let us become whole again. Okay, boys, we in trouble now. I have no idea what to expect here. Whoa. Oh, I can pick it up. Okay, interesting. No. Damn it. Uh, what do I drop? What do I drop? Actually, reload. And then drop the eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Oh, no. I'm not, not combine. Destroy. Pick it up. Pick it up. Can I equip it? Can't use this here. Okay. There we go. Okay. Ow. Keep missing. Time to move. Aha, okay. Whoa! The frickin' frack was that, son? Yeah, okay, hold on, hold on. We need health. We are dying. No, don't do that. Jesus. Uh, here's another one. Oh, I'm out. I am out. Okay. Flare gun it is. Combine. I mean, I hit her. Oh, that's a big hit. Oh boy. Uh yeah. Use another one of those. Oh, interesting. Ow. That is not what I thought I equipped. Uh it's the explosive ones I want. Whoa! Yeah, we're we are taking so much damage, god damn. Nice. Spear, pick it up. Get her. Great. Yeah, give me those. I cannot see a thing. There's so many of them. Maybe I can get quite a few of them in the one go. Ah. Combine. Use. Nice. Ah, every time I forget I have to reload it. Every time. <laughs> Shouldn't have stopped. Grab a spear. Come on. We can do this. Get her. We are not done yet. My god. We are not done yet.
This is so tough. Ah, oh, come on, every time. Okay, that's a decent hit. Okay, we're about to have, yeah, we're about to have a bad time. Oh, are we eating through the health items? We're in a lot of pain. No, don't die now. I have no more healing items. Nope, move. Warning. Is this our chance? This is our chance. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that was not easy. Violent scene missing. What? Oh, hey. It's her. Elster 512. Now we are one. I've been waiting for this for a long time. Once again. You've returned. Are you really willing to go through with this once more? You've seen what happens. This world cannot take much more. This may be our last chance. If you go back, it'll all fall apart. Can't let that happen. You selfish monster. Destroy everything. opened. Penrose Briefing Phase 2 Stat of Decrypted Transmissions By our calculations, 1500 cycles of mission time will have passed when you receive this message. Congratulations, comrade. By now, you should have become fully acclimatized to your new life on board your ship. As you approach the Oort Cloud, your search for new worlds will begin. Utilizing the long-range sensors, you will scout for valuable resources, habitable worlds, or signs of alien life. Remember to rely on your replica to assist you in maintaining your vessel. We all wish you great success in your mission. Okay, we can go up. We cannot go down. We cannot go left. So to the cockpit we go. 
Oh, I thought it was the cockpit. We got a ladder down. Or maybe it's not. Cycle 225. When I signed up for this mission, I just wanted to get away from everything. I was sick of Rotfront, of school, of the photo store, sick of the fake smiles and the whispering behind people's backs. So this is, um, yo. When I saw the photo of that soldier, I wondered who she was. Was she happy? Was her family proud of her? Did her comrades love her? Since we looked alike, could I have been like her? But in the end, I just wanted to leave. Nothing I had done or made ever meant anything to anyone, so why bother? Here, I'm finally free. I get to be by myself and to do what I want. I can finally be happy. Except I don't think you were. In the end, we didn't have the strength to dispose of them anymore. Cycle 648. Talk some more to the Elster unit. She's different from the replicas I knew back home. Nothing like my teachers or the block work protector. I know she didn't have a choice, but it feels like she's also here because she didn't fit in. It's like we've run away from the world together. First, I didn't like having someone around. I was glad that she's quiet and didn't approach me. But lately, I've missed having someone I can talk to. It's been so long since I've last seen another person. I never thought I'd miss it, except her. Everything is the same in here, always. Nothing ever changes. Penrose briefing phase three. Congratulations, comrade. You've survived 3,000 cycles, reaching the final phase of the Penrose program. With the end of the operational lifetime of your replica unit approaching, it is time to prepare for the final phase of your mission. If you have not found a suitable world for landing by this point, accept that you will not. Find solace in the thought that others might, find, might be successful where you failed. As you are probably aware, your ship's spare parts and rations will soon be depleted. Life support systems and reactor shielding will soon begin to fail and radiation may begin to leak from the cooling system. We recommend you do not attempt to prolong your suffering by reusing old filters or rationing supplies. Instead, make peace with your fate. We suggest that you ask your replica while it is still functional to spare you a slow and agonizing death or that you take permanent rest in the cryogenic pod. Remember, you will die having served your nation by partaking in a glorious demonstration of our power. It's kind of sad. Another unfinished painting. There never, there was never enough time. Oh, sorry, we read that already. Oh no, didn't want to go that way. Whoops. Yeah, the reactor's breaking down. Cycle 1294. Had a strange dream. I was listening to the radio with my mother. Like, like back then, the numbers were on, and mother was taking notes with a book on her lap. It was that book I saw in the shop window of the bookstore where the twins lived, the one with a yellow hooded figure on the cover. When I went there to buy it, it was gone, and Erica said the protectors had confiscated it. What was it, Issa? I can't remember. Cycle 1840. Everything's always the same. I feel like I'm trapped inside this ship. I know every bolt on every panel in every room of it. I've seen everything. I've done everything there is to do in here. I can't concentrate on anything. It's like there's this fog inside my head. And whenever I try to do anything, I just can't focus. I want to go outside. I want to breathe fresh air. I want to feel wind on my face and in my hair. Cycle 2503. I think I lost more hair. I'm sitting here getting older. Every time I wake up I feel older, weaker, sicker. I get out of breath so easily lately. My back hurts when I sit down. How much longer will this go on? It feels like I'm just slowly dying. The reactor cooling system is leaking irradiated coolant everywhere. I tried my best to patch it up but we eventually ran out of spare parts. So are these someone else's memories? that we're remembering.
We can go two ways. Cycle 5,000 and something. I'm tired of it all. Every time I go to sleep, I wonder if I'll wake, wake up again. I'm scared that it'll be the last time I said goodnight to her. Did I say it right? Will she be okay? What if one of us just won't wake up tomorrow? I don't want to die. I don't want to live anymore either. Everything is just so exhausting. I just want to lie down and disappear. I just want to sleep. Please just let me sleep. Please just make it stop. Please. This has a light, so I kind of want to go this way first. It's us. It's the Elster unit. I couldn't keep my promise. Despite my best efforts, I eventually fell ill too. It had to end this way. So this we're we're remembering this as if it was our own memories, even though we're a different unit. I think this is gonna be nasty. It's time. This is all that's left. Go home. I think so. Oh, she put herself in cryostasis. Or did she? I think so. She doesn't look all that older. Like, how, how, how long is the cycle? She is alive. I've come back for you. It's me, Elster. Elster? I'm sorry, but I don't remember. That's heartbreaking. It's okay. This is hell. Please, just let me stay by your side a little longer. very heartbreaking ending there's, there's quite a lot to break down and all that as well and I do genuinely think this is the actual ending <laughs> I mean I guess the the statement Adler made was if you do this again everything will break so maybe we can try it <laughs> see what happens um, but if this if this is the completion like this is the story the end of the story the game was really enjoyable um the mechanics the the horror the tense and kind of intimidating nature of the whole thing was brilliant um the story was a little difficult to follow at, at points because it a lot of the story was told in notes and in the background and that kind of stuff I, I get the overall picture that we were trying to return to here to to be with uh, Ariane. Obviously, that's that's the very evident part of the story, but I feel like there's a lot more under the surface that it's trying to tell us as well. Little bits and pieces. That, while may not be relevant to the, the main story, it's, it's world building and, and telling us, oh wow, special thanks to Guillermo del Toro. Um, 
the background stuff, the stuff in notes, the world building, the lore, it's it's telling us about the horrible stuff of, that happened and, and why it happened and that kind of stuff, which I think is a really, really cool world to have created here. I really enjoyed a lot of that. But yeah, thoroughly enjoyed that. A short enough game, only what, 10 or 11 hours I think it was, and that was being pretty thorough. But definitely thoroughly enjoyed that. It definitely scratched that itch of old school psychological horror. Like, like I know I've mentioned it quite a few times throughout, but like the Resident Evils, like the Silent Hills, that stuff that had puzzles but was was immersed in this dark, dingy, otherworldly horror. And I really, really, really like that. I really, really like that. Thank you for playing. So it was actually made in Hamburg, so that, that explains why there's so much German in it. Howard Phillips Lovecraft, the man, the myth, the legend. Oh, so there's multiple endings. Interesting. Interesting. So it does track the amount of death cheated. I'm not sure what that means. Maybe it's how, how many times... I'm not sure. Um, but it does tell me that it is tracking your saves, it is tracking your time, it is tracking your damage taken, how much your healing you used, how many enemies you killed. Maybe, I don't know how we trigger different endings, maybe I'll return and try to get a few of them. 10 hours per playthrough does feel like quite a bit of a commitment just to trigger other endings, unless it's stuff you can do relatively simply. Um, well, actually, we have the answers to some of the uh, the puzzles, so maybe we don't need to go and collect everything, but... Maybe we'll have a look at the different endings, but uh, that does that does uh, explain a lot. Oh, hold. Okay. Well, that is in fact that for now. So if I get if I get a, uh, I suppose I don't want to put a a hard limit on it, but if if this series gets enough attention or if people really want to see it, I'll I'll go and I'll. I'll try to get as many endings as possible. Um, but for now, this has been Signalis. And I very much enjoyed it. And I would recommend it to most people. Although you've had a lot of it uh, spoiled for you now, I suppose. The puzzles, the, the solutions, uh, and, and one of the endings. 
Um, but that said, if there's multiple more endings, go get this game, go play it yourself. It is a blast to play. It's really, really fun. It's The controls are good, the puzzles are, are good and, and clever, um, so I would definitely recommend this to anyone who enjoys those old retro style psychological horrors. But uh, I'll, I'll finish up gushing over this game now and I will bid you all a farewell. So as always, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you again real soon.